Hello everyone. Today we will discuss about RRNA that is ribosomal RNA. So the, the RNA of the ribosome is known as RRNA. RRNA forms about 80% of the total cellular RNA. RRNA is formed by the action of RNA polymerase 1. During the process of protein biosynthesis, mRNA and rRNA interact on the ribosomes. This rRNA is also known as catalytic RNA or ribozymes. Ribozymes. The ribosome is composed of a small subunit and a large subunit. Ribosome, it is composed of a small subunit and a large subunit. In prokaryotes, this ribosome is of 70S unit. 70S unit. Here the S is Swedberg unit. Swedberg unit. Swedberg unit is a unit for sedimentation coefficients. It depends on molecular weight and size. So, the 70S is this 70S is made up of 50S and 30S. Larger subunit is 50S and smaller one is 30S. This 50S is made of 23S RNA, 5S RNA, 23S and 5S RNA and 34 proteins, 34 proteins. Then this smaller subunit that is 30S is made of 16S RNA, 16S RNA and 21 proteins. 50S is made up of 23S and 5S RNA and 34 proteins. This smaller subunit that is 30S is made of 16S RNA and 21 protein. That is in prokaryotes. Then in eukaryotes, so total is, this one is 70S. Then in eukaryotes, it is um, of say 80s unit 80s unit here the s is swedberg unit this 80s is made of larger subunit and a smaller subunit a larger subunit is 60s 60s and smaller subunit is 40s and this larger subunit large subunit that is 60s is made up of 28s 5.8s and 5s rna 28s, 5.8s and 5s RNA and 40 proteins. That is 60s RNA, 60s subunit. Then this 40s subunit is made up of 18s RNA and 33 proteins. Here in 60s subunit that is 28s, 5.8s and 5s RNA and 40 proteins. Here in 40s subunit that is 18s RNA and 33 proteins. So coming to the function of rRNA, they are necessary for ribosomal assembly. Necessary for ribosomal assembly. Ribosomal assembly. And they help in and they help in binding of mRNA to ribosomes. Binding of mRNA to ribosome and for its translation. So that, that is the function of RRNA. So this is about RRNA. This is today's topic. Thank you for watching.